I actually came out today looking for something different. Um, I'm looking for Craterellus cornucopioids, I think they're called, um, that are black trumpets. And I've never found those and I was starting to get a bit disappointed and thinking about walking home. And as I turned, I just came across this. And this is one of the easiest things that I can teach you to identify. Uh, it's called a cauliflower fungus or Sparasis crisper. It grows at the base of trees, conifer trees. This is a Scots pine, I think. Um, I find it at the bottom of some cedars locally as well. Um, and it grows kind of on the roots or at the base of the tree. And it's got these amazing wibbly lobes. So rather than having caps of mushrooms, it's just got all of this. This is slightly past its best. We would usually expect it to be a bit more solid than that. Um, but the lobes, yeah, do this kind of wibbly wobbly curly thing. And from a distance, it really does look quite cauliflower-like. Um, ordinarily, there'd be a little bit more contrast. There'd be some, some paler bits and some darker bits. As I say, I think this one's just a little bit waterlogged, actually, rather than very old by the looks of it. Um, but yes, I think that there is very little that's this size. If you look at my hand on it, I mean, obviously they can be bigger and smaller than this. Um, there's very little that's this size growing at the bottom of a, a conifer that you're going to mistake it with. Um, there's a, a few kind of similar-ish looking little things that grow on, on smaller branches of things, but, but really nothing that similar. And this is fantastic edible mushroom. It really has a lot of depth of flavor, especially when it's dried, it dries very well. When you rehydrate it, you can use the uh, stock from the rehydration in your dishes. Um, makes a fantastic uh, stuffing for pasta, makes a really good risotto. Generally, all round, a pretty fantastic mushroom. And when you find one, you of often have enough to last you through the year. Uh, do press the subscribe button underneath. Um, obviously, it doesn't cost you anything super quick, but it would make a big difference to me. Um, if you want to be notified of other videos that I'm making, you can press the little bell next to it and that will notify you. Um, get out and enjoy your walk. I hope you find something equally beautiful.